that that's um that's also on display um you'll be able to see it from there um so yeah how is how is everybody feeling about the um the trailer but based on based on what we heard we, we, we obviously haven't uh we obviously don't own have access we're also going to be talking about um uh, the fact that there's there's going to be 30 songs and i'll be telling you guys what i think those 30 songs will be and we could play along with that as well uh i'm going to be reading the the article again so for those who aren't aware will uh you know so please whoever whoever's on here please share please share around this 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 also includes the youtube chat so please feel free to share this with everybody that you know that, that is interested in this uh, that will mean a lot to me. That that, that will mean a lot. Uh, I have a YouTube channel. For those who don't know, I make a ton of biopic updates on there. Um, my uh, my recent one is doing very well. So please uh, share that along. We want to make sure this the the the, uh, the biopic gets a gets a, a good amount of views. I'm going to share this on my other channels too, um, so that this just gets. A good amount. Uh, whoever's on here, we got 17 people on here now. We got another comment. Uh, the news is amazing, I'm, and, and I'm excited. My YouTube channel is Moonwalking Kingdom. Moonwalking Kingdom. I'm gonna type it. I'm actually gonna put the link in my in the here, so you guys can check it out. Um, I think that would be great to do. To do. Um, I hope this doesn't act like I'm self promoting, but just so that we can spread this even further here's my youtube channel link if for those who aren't familiar uh please share this around with everybody that would be that would mean a lot i'm gonna keep on doing this so yeah well we're gonna talk about the um all the, the songs they're gonna be in the movie we got a comment i know it's not majorly related but what do you think of the cm punk jack perry oh my god um we will dive into that later for those who for 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 the, for the YouTube live because I, I have a lot to say about that, but um yeah, <laughs> but um yo what's up How, how's everybody doing this is uh, I'm like connecting on a uh, connecting out here uh news is amazing so excited about the movie I'm about to faint before I before seeing it <laughs> um so yeah would you be interested in that? Uh, right, so I'm gonna pull that variety article again, just so we could uh, read that. I think I I think it was variety. I'm pretty sure it was variety. Um, but I'm, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to read that. Uh, so that, and then I'll I, and then I'll make commentary as well let me go on veronica's uh twitter because that there was a huge huge uh a lot a lot of information on there um so we got a cinemacon uh audience reacts to the first glimpse of the trailer apparently it was a rowdy applause a very loud applause um they're saying lionsgate shows off emotional intense look at the michael jackson biopic trailer uh the footage begins with scenes of screaming fans and cuts to jackson as a little boy whose mother tells him there might be some people who think you're different and that's going to make life a little harder for you but you never were like anyone else uh, in voiceover a grown-up jackson says of performing it transports your your entire being that's what i want the world to feel like magic so this is according to people who viewed it this is according to articles so i won't fully believe anything until i i watch it but this does sound very convincing um this does sound like something that they they would definitely do for a michael movie um with the mother and son exchange um i like that a lot uh they're saying some of the footage we saw today appears to take place during off the wall as well as that of bad uh, man in the mirror is a key song heard throughout we also see the pop singer's nephew jafar jackson his uncle michael uh, at one point, this voiceover says, when I'm not on stage, everything feels foreign to me. Voiceover then says, uh, to what appears to be Catherine Jackson, you have a very special light, so let the light shine to the world. And then they're also saying uh, that the film will be very long. Uh, 
probably in. So if if, if they mean very long, then they're probably they're probably going to shoot for the three hour mark. Let me let, let me let me catch these comments here. Um, there's some cool edits going around for the movie. Uh, yeah, you you're you're sending these out. These look really cool. Um, so yeah, they're saying that the film is going to be pretty long. Um, I personally wouldn't be surprised if it's 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 going to be three hours. Um, King of Kings eighty four. We got some people on YouTube. Here. We're, we're we're already talking about songs. <laughs> it's crazy. Uh, we will jump right into that. Uh, they also stated that it's going to cover his whole life. I wonder how they will handle this is it. If this is the, if they're going to do this is it, then I really don't know how they're going to implement that. Um, they, they might even just, they might even just throw in like maybe, oh, Michael was going to do this concert, but, 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 but he never did it. Kind of, kind of like how it, it's much more of like a in in memoriam type sequence rather than a whole scene, and uh, so I mean I don't know how they're gonna treat that, but they they're probably going to bring it up because like if if they're if they're doing like an like like your typical biopic where it's like chronological, although I would have loved if um they did something involving like like certain points of his life rather than his whole life, but but considering that this is made for the public, um. They're obviously aiming to do his whole life, but really, really focusing on those moments where, you know, it summarizes him as a person, judging, judging by the title of the film. Um, let me read some of these comments on YouTube. Sounds accurate. They said the same thing about Bohemian Rhapsody, whether they show the trailer for that movie, a CinemaCon, and release that part of the trailer in July. Okay, th then that's really good then. That's very good then. Um and Bohemian Rhapsody was uh, almost a three-hour film. That was like two hours and 49 minutes. Uh, for those who are coming on both YouTube and Twitter, uh, feel free to share. I also just shared this on my Instagram. Uh, for those who don't have my Instagram, it is moonwalking underscore kingdom. Um, so definitely um, check that out. Let's hope five hours. Uh, dang, five hours. I, I don't think that sounds realistic. I don't recall any biopic. Well, here's the thing. Jackson's American Dream was a TV special with multiple parts, adding up to four hours. Um, let me see what these comments are. I assume uh, TV Holic J says, I assume they're going to approach This Is It air just like they did with Freddy's and Bohemian Rhapsody. Um, longer than J5. We already read that. Um, okay, so... Anybody else? We have about 30 people on Twitter. We have 15 on YouTube. Let me see if we could um, divide it so we could get 60. <laughs> uh, definitely did, de definitely keep sharing this, guys. Uh, we we want to make sure this 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 reaches a, a good audience, man. We, we It's already reaching a, 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 a pretty big audience, judging by the people who positively received, um, who, who gave this so, so much positive reception already. Um, Regarding leaks, I don't think we'll get a leak until – well, it's, it's not going to be a leak. It's going to be from Lionsgate, Lionsgate themselves. Um, I also saw this, but I don't – I don't – I don't – this is – please, please correct me if this is, like, not what they said because I found this. I, I really – I really don't want to believe – I don't want to believe everything I read, obviously. But here, but here they're saying, did you see the video I sent you? Um, send it again. Uh, Jafar Jackson portrays him in the film. The footage covers all the iconic eras from Jackson's career, starting with the humble beginnings of Jackson 5 with his hit song ABC playing in the back. Uh, we can see a montage of that goes from J5 performing on television to the Jackson to Jackson and Thriller. We see Michael's iconic white socks and black shoes as, as, as he's dancing, as he as he's dancing while singing bad. Jafar Jackson sounds just like his uncle when delivering dialogue. Michael is shown later in his career after one of the accidents with a black hat, face mask, and sunglasses flanked by security. Um, he's walking towards a car while a crazy crowd of fans and paparazzi screaming for him and even trying to jump on the car to even get a glimpse. Michael's mom tells a young Michael while she's wiping a tear, you were never like anyone else. We then get a close-up of Michael's hand snapping, performing Man in the Mirror. We see a young Michael sign thriller records with his short hair and iconic red jacket. Then there's a glimpse of Michael with his face wrapped up in gauze, on a stretcher being led to into a hospital. 
assuming this is a big Pepsi commercial. The trailer directly confirms that this biopic will address the controversy of Jackson's career. The next image is Michael on a balcony, which could be the baby dangling incident. Okay, so if 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 they if if they touch on that, which I you know looking looking at how they're going to be treating the 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 um the life here, I won't be surprised if they dive into that because again, this is more of a fact of understanding the man, and then it'll 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 be. It seems like there's there there's there's, there's going to be a, uh, a a heavy divide on the person and the artist uh, aspect here. Um, one night only hospitalization. I don't know if they'll do that. I have a lot of hopes for the biopic, also because I know that Jafar loves his uncle and I will do anything to keep his image high. That says Emma on YouTube. Uh, let me continue. Tell me uh, how what you all think. Then there then then this this is saying. The next image, uh, uh, there, there's a quick shot of Michael sitting on a, at, at a piano and taking a pill. We see quick glimpses of Neil Long and Coleman Domingo as Michael's parents in his youth. And the trailer ends with a shot of Michael in the white shirt and black pants combo uh, performing. Uh, I think that the, the, the part I was cut um, from the shot uh, when I when I screenshotted it. But, um, yeah, yeah. Um, somebody sent me something, but I'm going to I'm going to look at that right now. Give me one second. But I'm still gonna be on here. You, 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 you guys could still hear me. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I saw this. Yeah, I saw this. A lot of people are, you know, saying how much they love Jafar, and and it's it's a great thing. It's it's such a great thing, um, to uh, to hear. So, what I'm gonna do now is I'm going to, I am going to tell you what i think the, the 30 songs will be this is uh so it seems like they're doing uh somebody somebody just requested on um here i think they wanted to say something if if anyone wants to come on as a guest on youtube you 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 guys can as well um uh, uh, let me see if uh we get and uh, see if anybody did it. Uh, um, okay, so while, while while we wait on that, I'm gonna I'm gonna tell you what I feel these thirty songs will be. So, looking at how this is, um, it seems like there's gonna be five J five and twenty five Michael songs. So it, maybe maybe those other twenty five can be. Anything involving like the Jacksons or, or uh, something like that. So here's here's what I'm gonna do. Uh, oh, we have Jenny on here. How how's uh, on uh, Twitter? Um, April 18, 25. Cannot come fast enough. I 100% agree. I am very excited. I I want to do a uh, New York meetup eventually as well. I think I think that would be really cool to do something like that. Um, okay. On YouTube, feel free to like up the video. Um, all right, let's um, let's keep on going. Thirty songs. Okay, so if I if I could name uh, five songs at the top of my head, you guys could put down some songs that you think will be in the biopic uh, in the uh, chat here. Uh, we'll. Uh, We'll talk about that. Um, so I'm gonna I'm gonna say right now the five songs that I think will be in the biopic um, for J five. So I'm gonna I'm gonna just say the the five obvious ones are A B C Love You Save Want You Back I'll Be There and if I had to say one more it's gotta be Who's Loving You. Uh, Who's Loving You is a very important one. So I I think. Just including that, considering the fact that I could just see an, an Ed Sullivan show and a American Bandstand scene, if if they're including, um, if if they're including Dick Clark, then Ben Ben, I I could see Ben. So so that's six. Seven would be um, um, shake your body. Eight, I could see um, blame it on the boogie. 
Have you seen Daniel MJ's fan made soundtrack? Uh, no, send it. Send it. Send it on my Instagram if you haven't. Who's loving you has to be. Yes. Um, Ben, I I think I said let me let me let me list them on uh, on the on a uh, thing here because I. Hmm, I just uh, lost my train of thought. I have a lot of uh, things I have to deal with here. <laughs> um, okay. Okay, so I'm going to write some of this down. Uh, bah, bah, bah. This place hotel will be there, definitely, unless they take it out. Um, okay, so let me do ABC. Want you back? I want you back. I'm I'm literally typing this. I'm gonna I'm gonna for 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 the YouTube live. I'm gonna share my screen so you guys could see what I'm doing. Um, how do I um? No, I can't do that. Very very weird. All right, I'm gonna share my here. Uh, <laughs> wow, what was that? A uh, big boy leading up to Motown would be great. Big boy is a must. Big boy is a must. I want you back. The love you save. I'm typing right here. Um, I'll be there. Who's loving you? Big boy. This is not in any particular order. Ben. Music and me. Music and me is a must. Um, let me see what I have. Um, blame it on the boogie. Dancing machine. Uh, can you feel it? If you're doing thirty, then I. Oof. Um. Okay, now I I think we should really start with like just 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 to play it safe. Let's start with this solo stuff. Off the wall. No, no. Rock with you. Don't stop till you get enough. Um, Want to be starting something. Billy Jean. Thriller. Thriller beat it. Um, human nature. Bad. The way you make me feel. The way you make me feel. Smooth criminal. Man in the mirror. Um, let's see, let's see what people are saying. I don't, I think I have to refresh my page. I said the love you save. Yep. Um, okay. I have seven more here, so I have to really like think, um, remember the time well, let me put a deep cut. Let me, let me put a deep cut. Price of fame. Uh, will you be there? I, 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 you already know. Black or white. Cream. Stranger in Moscow. Earth song. Uh, they don't care about us. I actually like I I actually I really don't know like I like I I actually don't know how they're gonna do the mm, money like, I I could see money and then I could see uh, for some reason I just want four all time and they're so bad but um what other ones would you want to see because again they're saying thirty songs so we got some uh, stuff to pick. Um, I would also love to say Heal the World. I, I totally forgot about Heal the World. I'm an idiot for that one. Oh, oh. Um, so let me so let me take out one of these. Is Ben Blame on the Boogie, honestly? Uh Dancing Machine, can you feel it? Rock with you. Bad smooth criminal man in the mirror. Uh, yeah, this is this is just so yeah. Not every song. Well, I won't be surprised if there is a working working thing. But if they uh, take out a few and add, 
I, I also wouldn't be surprised. I also need to put in a Heartbreak Hotel because that is, I'm pretty sure that is confirmed. Let me take out Blame on the Boogie for now and put in a Heartbreak Hotel. Let me catch up with these YouTube comments. Uh, jam. Uh, someone saying Jam. Raymond uh, is saying Jam. Uh, this time around, Ghosts Gone Too Soon. I wasn't thinking God Too Soon. Childhood is a must. I'm going to put Childhood here. Um, let me put that instead of uh, black or white for now because it's, it, 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 it's so hard to pick. No, this is it. Climb every mountain. That's a must. Uh, let me, let me, let, okay. Should I, should I break the rule? Uh, I don't know if I'll break the rules <laughs> uh, with this because again, they did say 30 songs. So, Okay, somebody put in Man in the Mirror, Thriller, Bad, Beat It, Billy Jean, Black or White, Stranger of Moscow, Blood on the Dance Floor, Just Good Friends. I can't see them put in Just Good Friends. Uh, I Just Can't Stop Loving You, This Place Will Tell, Off the Wall. We Are we are the World. Yeah, I forgot about We Are the World. Uh, Heal the World, Blame Under the Boogie, Rock With You, Scream. Liberian Girl. Uh, I, 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 I won't be surprised if they implement that somewhere. I'd love for the trailer music to be starting something. Apparently the, what we heard most in the trailer was man in the mirror. Um, that's what people heard apparently when they saw it in CinemaCon. Uh, let's see what they're saying. Money, price of fame, tabloid junkie were amazing to illustrate the storyline of MJ, the musical. I think they'll use them for the story. Money was using, um, uh, in the musical, money was used in a different different context, but it still was great. Uh, I sort of spoil, I kind of spoiled the show a little bit for those who haven't seen. It. If if you haven't seen the show, MJ, please see it. It's amazing. That that's if you can. Uh, Price of Fame is great. Tabloid Junkie, that's another great song. They they I can see them put in the biopic. I see them putting in popular tracks for the audience. Yes, replace for all time with this is it. Hmm. This is it. I can see them doing it. Um, if if we're talking like unreleased songs, I can see that be on the soundtrack. Uh, what about Big Boy? Yeah, I, I put in Big Boy on this list. They're going to have to do Remember the Time. Uh, okay, anybody else on Twitter, on IG? I'm saying IG. On... Um, yeah, uh, what do you guys want to talk? Uh, what do you guys want to talk about? Oh my god, that's a wrestling reference. Um, Dirty Diana, Break of Dawn. Uh, did I did I, did I cover a lot? Let me let me just uh, respond to this email real quick. Uh, but luckily, um, this has this is this is a feature. Let me just um. Yeah, I hope I covered everything that I that I needed to. Um. Oh, I think that there's a page uh, on Twitter regarding biopic updates it's that france uh, francesco i think his name is he's really really, really good really okay great Sorry about that. Nothing put it. Uh, he's on down the road. <laughs> it's. Uh, I won't be surprised if they touch the Wiz. I. I also. I also won't be surprised if they don't touch on uh, Captain EO. I just don't. For some reason, I just. I, I don't know. I. Captain EO is. You rock my world. Over this is it. One more chance would be great. Michael was filming the short film when he had to leave set because of the allegations. Strong point. I I, I think um, one more chance. One more chance would be good. They got to include Louise. Say say say. That's Paul uh, McCartney's song. But, but but again, I I I I wouldn't be surprised if they would implement that. Like you know maybe the girl is mine. I I I don't I don't know. This this is a I don't know but but the, but the, but the definite circuit are, are like who's loving you man in the mirror Billy Jean, um, uh, DS uh, ah, I would like that 
Um, for unreleased songs, I wish Dream Away as a new song. I think that would be really nice, but I don't know. I really don't know how they're going to handle unreleased material. Which they we will probably get new stuff. I'm just gonna say it. Probably on just the um, soundtrack, but it's it's probably gonna be flooded with complaints as they might do another escape type thing. Probably I don't know. Shake your body, yeah, shake your body. I I, I could I could definitely see shake your body on there. Um, apparently they 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 start filming at Neverland in like the next couple of weeks. Centipede. I don't I don't think that I I don't think they're gonna put centipede. Um, imagine if we see a, a mic in the studio recording a new song. I don't think they'll put that in the biopic, but if they have him sing something like a like a cover, he he was gonna put out, but they never did. I think that'd be really cool. Tom Mesero has to be in the movie, like someone casted as Tom Mesero. Yeah. Um. But uh, they have um, the uh, John Branca take that over. Uh, I, I I I I don't see them putting none of his unreleased songs. No, not in the movie. No, not in the movie. I think they'll probably do it separately. They'll do it like on the soundtrack if they if they were to put it like an unreleased song. Growing your life away, full HD. I don't think we're gonna get that. Uh, we 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 need childhood in the biopic. Yes. Hundred times yes, hundred times yes. Ch childhood. I I actually wish childhood was in the musical. Like I like I love it that much. Um, what about maybe Blood on the Dance Floor? Michael was filming the video around the same time Prince was born. Uh, I I would like to see Blood on the Dance Floor in in a way. They could play Lady in My Life thirty times, and I'd be okay with that. Heaven can wait. I don't see it. We need gone too soon. Yes. What about Frank DeLeo? I, they have to add Frank DeLeo. He's very important. What you make of childhood gone too soon with your memory Ryan White being in the movie? Gone too soon. Here's the thing about gone too soon. I think they're. I think they're gonna make it like they'll they'll apply that song to Michael instead of Ryan White. But I I would like I would like them to to touch on Ryan White. And uh, Heal the World Foundation, which they most likely will touch on Heal the World. Um, I know who is it will be in the who is it being in the biopic would be great. Man in the Mirror, it definitely seems like that main song that they want to they they want to reach for the movie. Um, so that's that's very good. We need Heal the World. Yes, I I brought up Heal the World being in the movie. Uh, I don't get how Michael never released that that song as a single. Oh my god! I wonder who's gonna play Ryan White. That's if they. Sorry, just something something came up for work. Just to, you know. Uh I actually have to get out um in like another half hour, so I'm probably gonna because I I I I have to go on my uh, college campus today because they, they need me for something. Um, and I have to be there late because I'm I'm actually involved in a production, so and uh, they 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 need my help. <laughs> um, I'd love to see Jafar in the set of Moonwalker and Jafar singing with Saida Garrett. And I just can't stop loving you with one in front of them looking at. It. Um, they won't include Price of Fame, really. I. I mean, I could see them include it, but I wouldn't be surprised if they didn't. Um, do you think they're going to include any interviews? Oh, they have to include interviews. They have to include interviews. They 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 need to. Some biopics do include unreleased music, but when I saw Whitney, they had an unreleased song playing on the limo. 
Oh, wow. I forgot about that. Smile. Yeah, I mean, I would like them to include, like, other songs, like, you know, like, uh, you know, like, like his favorite songs. I mean, I mean, they, they could do that. Uh, somebody we have two, uh, somebody requested. We have two people who are requested uh, for those people who are requested. Just put a thumbs up if you want to uh, just so that I know that you're that, that you're coming in to talk. Um, let me, uh, Oprah interview. I interesting. I, they might, they might include that. With a laughing emoji so all right but I'm, I'm i'm probably gonna i'm probably gonna end this soon anyway because we have more than one requesting and i'm probably not going to request uh we got i swear i hope i don't see a glimpse of oprah in the biopic <laughs> um i have no idea if 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 we'll if, if we'll get anything like that i mean we're, we're, regarding most interviews i don't even know what interviews they're going to include so that's that that that's a question that that I have. Uh, I love to see her interview with Gerardo Rivera. Uh, I get her interview. I think if they were to choose an interview, I would probably say um, Ebony Jet um, and I, I would say the one with uh, I don't think they'll do it. They're not gonna do this. But they, the Michaels. I think his greatest interview that he's ever done was the one with his, with that with that Brett guy in uh, two thousand three. That was a phenomenal interview. But I don't know if they'll include that, as that's not like a publicized interview. Maybe Barbara Walters, only because he says the whole um, uh, with the thing about um. I'm not even gonna say it, but you, 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 you guys know what I'm talking about. Um, if they touch on Lisa Marie, uh, do you, do you guys think they will bring up or even cast a Lisa Marie Presley? Um, if they don't, then it's probably because of there's you know a lot of coverage of that already. But, like, but well, no, well, well, I don't know what I mean by that. But like, I wouldn't be surprised if they did that. Uh, regarding a James Brown role, um, they could probably mention James Brown. I I, I, I I would like to see James Brown in the movie, but I'm going to be 100%. If they don't put James Brown in the film, I mean, you have to mention him. You have to show him. But as someone playing him, um, I, I mean, all all respect to um, Chadwick Boseman because he played James Brown in the James Brown biopic um, and uh, it's going to be difficult to, you know, replicate that uh, unless you get somebody to get really good. But I think it's all about respect at the end of the day. Uh, they need to include young Michael saying whatever, uh, saying that's what I really mean. Oh, yeah, that, that, that is definitely that is definitely going in the biopic because they casted Dick Clark uh, and that interview was with Dick Clark. Um, so that is definitely that will definitely be in the movie. I can guarantee that will definitely be in the movie. OMG, leave me alone has to be included. Leave me alone would be nice. Leave me alone would be really nice. Let me um um stop sharing my screen on YouTube. Uh, we have um 27 people on um Twitter and 28 people on YouTube. So uh, this was really really nice. Um, I'll be on here for a couple uh, like like another 10 minutes, and then I'm I'm probably gonna get settled um with the few other things I, I have to take care of but if anybody else has anything they want to say feel free to i'm going to see what i else i could find they have to address lisa marie she's a very important person but if they don't it was probably because of presley's estate yeah I, I i i think that was another thing i had in my mind uh also with now the fact that lisa marie is no longer with us um it might be a little difficult um what are your thoughts on bobby brown uh, love is music, man. Love Bobby Brown. Um, Don't Be Cruel is my favorite Bobby Brown album. Uh, also, Top of Tower Junkie, I think, is a good one. Um, Lionsgate having Graham King talk about Michael such a W. Yeah, I saw that uh, tweet. Um, 
then they're saying, uh, you say Michael Jack. Oh, yeah, yeah, we already, we already read this. Um, yeah, we read most of that already. Um, about the, 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 the crowd at CinemaCon lost their minds when they saw the Michael biopic teaser with loud applause. If this is the reaction to the first trailer, imagine the scenario when the biopic drops. We got a couple tweets here. I'm going to read. Um, I saw the first footage of Michael um, at CinemaCon. This is from Scan Scott Manns. And wow, Jafar Jackson looks sensational as his uncle Michael Jackson. Movie's only halfway through production. It, 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 it'll feature 30 Michael Jackson songs and Coleman Domingo and Neil Long look great. Opens in 2025. Uh, Daniel Howitt says we got a first look at Michael, which is currently in production. Uh, we saw flashes of Michael stages as an adult. Long time outside him. Jafar Jackson looks looks really looks the part. Looks like a birth to death sort of biopic. Uh, we got um solid footage of Michael, the Michael biopic. It's gonna make billions. Um, so nothing, nothing but great things, nothing but great things, and that's what I like to see. Uh, do you think the biopic will take home Oscars? Um, I could see, I could see a Golden Globe. I mean, we'll 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 have to see. What? Because again, you're you're competing with a lot of a lot of movies, you know. Like like imagine this movie going head to head with Oppenheimer. Okay, Oppenheimer was phenomenal. So I don't I that and 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 I can I can understand like why that one, uh, especially if you're putting like Elvis lost to um what was that uh, movie um. The oh, that won 2023 Oscars. Everything I think it was like every everything everywhere all at once. That was the movie that won. Uh, but then and then you had Brendan Fraser for uh, the Whale, which is also a very good movie. Um, yeah, Elvis never got anything. Um, but all, all Austin Butler won an award and a, and a Golden Globe for that. I know Fra um Rami Malek won um an Oscar. For his performance, I know, I know that. Um, so let's so let's see what um. Let's see what the. Uh, let's see if this biopic uh, takes takes um. Home any awards? I'm actually very interested, um, to see if that will be the case i'm very interested in that so i mean the, the thing, i think i think i think i think yeah i can't even talk i think that's a topic that we will we will we will know for sure um once we see like critics and you know, critics reviewing it which i i personally think critics are going to love it um but again we'll 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 have to see more information uh, I, I just got a tweet um, uh, on something on my feed i said um what if there's a scene of him playing um, Super Soaker and Water Balloon? I I could I could see that. I heard critics say this movie is going go, going for Oscar buzz. Okay, we're talking about the recreation where he brought Michael and Prince on stage. Oh yeah, the James Brown bringing Michael and Prince on stage. Yeah, but here's the thing. Um. If they put in that um that the prince thing right the um when he's uh yeah I feel like that will yeah 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 I'll just take the bus um sorry something got a little carried away John Campia said it definitely looks Oscar worthy okay um that's really good to hear uh but anyway guys. Uh, I'm probably gonna go. Um, this was really cool to come on and you know, um, you know, uh, talk about this with you guys regarding the biopic. We got 28 people on this YouTube, and uh, if anyone else has anything they want to say, also feel free to uh, click on my latest video uh, regarding the trailer for the biopic. I'm going to put it on the chat box here so you guys can check it out. Uh, feel free to follow my Instagram for those who are on YouTube. Um, and turn on your, please turn on your notifications. Uh, that, that'll mean so much. 
Uh, for those on Twitter, I'm gonna go. Um, let me just, uh, for those on Twitter, I'm I'm gonna stay on YouTube for a little bit. So hang on tight. I I got a few YouTube things to talk about. Um, and then uh, for Twitter, I'm signing off. Um, I'm gonna put my YouTube channel down in the thing again. I think I think you guys can have access to the to there. So. So you guys can view that. Um, so yeah, YouTube, hang on. I got some YouTube things to take care of. So um, let's uh, get on there. So for for um, Twitter, take care and bye bye. Uh, so yeah, um, for YouTube, I, I got a couple announcements. Uh, you know, this this was this was awesome. This was awesome. Okay, uh, wow, somebody sent me the. Soundtrack, music and me, film edit. I'm gonna definitely check this out. Um, yeah. Uh, I got some videos coming up. I got some rants. I got some cool things I want to talk about. There's another SpongeBob movie. What? Sorry, I'm just I'm just getting this now. What? The SpongeBob movie, Search for SquarePants. They, they don't need. They didn't need another one. Oh. What? Um, you can you see them having someone playing Teddy Riley? You played a big part in the yeah. I can see that happen. Thank you, Joey, for all you do for us. I appreciate it that y'all just came on and and all this. So, and I hope that you guys have a great rest of your day. Um, I'll be doing more videos. I'll be I'll also be talking about the um that Michael theme park thing. I I. Kind of refuse to even uh, put up uh, content for it because I've just been so lazy with it and so lazy with a lot of stuff. I've just been su super focused on school and a lot of other things, but I want to get back into that. Uh, there, there will be a video series on that, so feel free to check that out when when I drop that. It, it'll probably be a weekly thing that I'll be dropping every week. Um, do you think Giuliano and Jafar will be singing in the film? I think they'll be singing or... I, I, I won't be surprised if it's a half and half type thing. Um, Eric Critic saying the book. Oh, yeah, I already read that. So, yeah, if you guys enjoyed, uh, please put a like. Please. Um, that would mean a lot. Um, and, and get that views. Get the views up on the latest video. Because the biopic needs so much coverage um anyway you guys take care i'm gonna go i'll see you all bye bye